want to welcome everybody to a beautiful, sunny, warm day here in Storrs, Connecticut. It's a monumental day. We want to thank all of you for being here, but we want to recognize those that have uh, represented us in the Olympics. For 11 years I've been dreaming about it and, uh, and finally we were able to make it a reality. A lot of pieces came together. Thank you to all of you. Thank you to the Olympians who are here today. Let's unveil it. Oh, it just, it fills me with pride. You know, it's like I'm a mom of two now, I've got my own career, and you know, these elite athlete days seem like such a thing of the past. And so to bring up those memories and to be here to commemorate that with all of these other Olympians just brings me back to those wonderful days of being an athlete traveling the world and going to the Olympic Games. It's like you kind of look around and think, wow, this is pretty incredible. Whatever the odds are for it is in each sport to, to have a chance to represent your country in that way is, is incredible. So it's nice that, that people are being um, recognized in that way when they might not you know, be household names because of the, the sport that they play. The most important part of this statue is that it recognizes all of the athletes that we have. We have such an Olympic family here and it finally recognizes everybody that's been part of the Olympic teams over the years that it's the future, that every time a student athlete is being recruited to come to UConn, they have to know that they can come to UConn to achieve their academic dreams and their athletic dreams and it's all part of the package. This experience is overwhelming. It really is. Um, I am truly honored. I could never even imagine that this would have happened. And it's so wonderful seeing my teammates and my coach. And I'm trying not to cry because this is just really amazing. One more time, fans, for our UConn.